Are we ready, friends? Are we ready to live our best mushroom life? Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, new game. Oh, okay, okay, let's make our character. I'm so excited. Okay, okay, what have we got? Hairstyles. Um, okay. Oh, pronouns. Love, love that. She, her. Hairstyles. We have, we have sticky out butterfly. We have wormy. We have love heart. We have bee. We have stick, which is, I guess is long hair. And we have little sprout hair. Oh, I don't know. It's between these two. Wait, this one and this one. I kind of like the really, really like sticky out hair. I might go for the sticky out hair. Oh, I wish I could have green skin. Never mind. I'll go for the sticky out hair. Hair color, I'll just go for like red. Dark red, probably dark red. Skin tone, pale AF. Okay, outfit colors. We have red, yellow, green, blue, purple, or pink. Oh, I don't know. I kind of like the red, because it's got like the mustard on there. I kind of like the yellow. The green's really cute too. The green and the brown. Oh, I kind of like the yellow though, because the yellow is like yellow and orange. I might go for yellow. Ye yellow's really cute. Let's do backpack colors. So we've got brown. We've got, oh. Wait for it to turn around. Oh, pause, pause. There we go, right, okay. We can pause it so we can look at what we're doing. Okay, so the backpack, we've got that one. Oh, a little leaf one. We've got this little, oh, it's like a little basket. <gasps> a little flowery one. An acorn or like a little patchwork one. Oh, I don't know. I, I kind of really like the little basket one. The basket one's really cute. But the acorn's really cute too. But I really like the little basket because it's got like the little bit coming out the back. Okay, I think I like that one. Backpack color. Oh, you can change the color of the backpack. Oh, I kind of do like it in the, the yellow though. Okay, glider. What's our glider? Okay, we've got mail, that one, a dirty letter. Oh, that one's kind of cute. I like that one. I think I'm gonna go for this one, like the parcel looking one, that one's cute. Okay, right, I'll press play again so we can have a look at the character. So that's our little glider. Oh, it's like a little mail with a flower on it. Oh, that's cute. I know, I think you can unlock more hats later on as well, so. Okay, I think we are good, so. Maury, I'm just gonna call her Maury because it's a me. It's a me, Maury. Okay, I think we're good. She, her. Okay, cool, cute. Here we go. Cute. Are we there yet? No. Maury. Oh, sorry. How about now? No. What about? Stop it. Will you shut up if I if I tell you where we're going? Promise. All right. Now don't get too excited, but today is your first solo delivery. What? Yes! My ears! Oh, sorry. Right, so. Oh, it's what a cute, oh, the background, just like everything is so adorable. Okay, so you got it right. Yep. Wait, no, one more time. <sighs> Listen closely this time then. You, you Maury, me, Maury, I need to deliver that. I need to deliver that letter in your backpack to someone called Greg. Deliver letter to Greg. Since it's your first day on the job, first but not last. Right, yes. You probably know a bit about what it's like to be a mail scout. Yes, sir, Janet. I mean, ma'am. I'm top of the class of the mail academy. Oh well, I'm top ten, ish. But I'm ready to learn. Well, it's one, one thing to learn from the books, and another thing to learn in real life. Mail Scout Official Handbook, page 12. Good one, Janet. T try me on another one. Scout, what did we say about interrupting thing? Not to do it? Yes, please, try. Before you're ready to deliver your letter to Greg, we should do a practice run. See the turtle over there? I want to give him this note from me. You might just get something special for it. In case you forgot how your legs work, you can use the, obviously, the analog stick to walk around. Aye aye, Captain Jan, be right back. 
I love how our character was also changed. So when we were talking, my character was the same character that I created. Like, what the hell? What, talk about putting effort into the game. That's so cool. All right then. Oh, look at our little bee. Here's our little character. Oh, okay, turtle. We gotta find the turtle. Oh yeah, this is different from the demo as well. This is so different from the demo. So this is like awesome. It's like playing all over again. Oh, I didn't even introduce it. <laughs> I'm such a bad streamer. This is mail time. A cute, cozy game where you're a little mail person delivering mail. And I'm super excited. Oh my god, I'm sitting down. I'm so, so cute. I have played the demo, but it was a while ago. And they've changed it. It's like literally so different from the demo. So, okay. Hello, turtle. Uh, hi. Uh, are you here for my autograph? Oh, do I have to get mail signed before I can deliver it? I don't remember that from the handbook. Oh no. I mean, do you want my autograph because I'm famous? Oh, what for? I'm a trek star in the, uh, training for my next race. Uh, Speedy Shelby, they call me. Your name is Shelby then? This letter is for you. Oh, fan mail. Of sorts. Let's see it then. This is a fake letter. Just pretend that you're reading it. <laughs> it's our first delivery. Oh, I see. Is that your supervisor over there? That's Janet. She's my boss. Or something like that. I'm not really sure. In that case, I accept this letter. It was delivered to me following Mail Scout protocol. I am ec ecstatic with the service I have received. Five stars. No, wait. Four and a half stars. Why four and a half stars? You didn't want my autograph. Oops, sorry. But, but, by the by, do you happen to know where Greg is? Not currently. My brain is, is on sport mode. Information irrelevant to exercise can be accessed. I can't be ac accessed right now. Maybe Egbert knows. He's clever. Squirrel man. Can't miss him. Asking around is the best way to find people around here. Thanks for the tip. Bye, Shelby. Peace out, little scout. <gasps> Cute. Have I got to talk to Janet again? Maybe I have to talk to Janet again. Because I delivered the mail. And he said to go talk to someone as well. Right, let's talk to Janet. Chief Janet, I'm back. Visibly? I heard you gave a letter to Shelby. Huh? Where did you hear that? Can't easy to miss. Good job, Scout. That means you've earned your first patch. Oh, we got a patch. Gracious, you earned a stamp and sealed patch. With love, male Scouts. Woo! Yippee! So our Scouts work on a patch system. Uh, once you've done something noteworthy, you earn a patch for it. Uh, with every patch you get a little closer to being a real mail scout you get a little bit better at mail delivering for example you might have noticed that you can jump by pressing a well by holding a you can glide as well <gasps> Ooh, that's amazing i'm literally never gonna touch the ground ever again well sure why not do her dream big anyways when you deliver the letter to greg you'll get your official mail scout patch you'll be full you'll be a full mail scout for real ah, i can't wait Good luck, Murray. I'll be here if you need anything. Thanks, Mom. Oh, I mean Mrs. Mayo. Oh, I mean, I mean Janet. Bye. Oh, don't forget. You can press Y to check your deliveries and patches in your handbook. Okay, thank you, Janet. Thanks, Janet. Damn it, Janet. Right, okay. I guess we just wander around because we got to look for... Wait, what's that little symbol up there? What does the little symbol mean? Okay, so Greg delivery. We can't click on that. We've got our scout patch. And then we've got like whatever this is. Okay. So I guess, oh, can we like collect things? So we've got like a little glider. <gasps> a little glider. We got bluebells. There's something up there. It looks like a teapot. Can we get up there? Can we get up here? I'm like hacking my way to the top. Oh, hello. Am I meant to talk to you? Oh, snowdrop. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Is it glitching out? Hang on. Psst. <laughs> My game! Oh no, I'm glitching it. Psst. What? Uh, hello? What's going on? You have to whisper. I'm afraid mum will find out what happened. As I was trying to find the meteorite, I was swinging uh, the telescope around a bit. Turns out I was swinging a bit too much. Before I knew it, the telescope was broken. And now the stars are far away again. Can you help me fix it? No problem. It looks like the lens is broken. There's a bit of thick glass inside the telescope. Oh, I know what, I, oh, I know what part you mean. So the lens from the pair of glasses would work? That could work great. Okay, well, I did see some around, but I don't really remember where. It was either near Kiki or Donna. Don't worry, Snowdrop, I'll figure it out. Thanks, Maury. And please don't tell Mum. I wouldn't dream of it. 
Okay, love. I will sort that out. I don't even know if I was meant to be up here yet. Was I even meant to be here? Who knows? Who knows? Oh, I love how it's made from a little teapot. Look how cute. It's like it's made from a little teapot. Oh, it kept zooming in and out. I think it was stuck or something. Oh, look at the flowers. All of the tiny things. Like I said, tiny things make me feral. Tiny little things. Feral. <gasps> it's a bike made from buttons and sticks. Oh, stop it. That's adorable. What the heck? No, stop it. It's too cute. I can't cope. I <laughs> know, it's making me feral. <laughs> Oh, it's Donna! Oh, and the lens is here! Hi, Donna! The snail! Hello! Oh, uh, what are you doing here? Hi! I'm delivering mail. Oh, that sounds fun. Uh, my name's Donna. What's your name? Maury. It's great meeting you, Maury. Uh, what are you up to, Scout? I'm working on a big delivery. For someone named Greg? Do you know him? Oh, no, sorry. I'm pretty new into this area. No worries, thanks anyway. Thanks, Donna. Oh, look, we can get the lens. Thank you. So, right, let's go give the to the telescope because then maybe we can like. Oh, there's something glowing over there. <gasps> oh, we got a bottle cap. Nice. Oh, what's over here? No, don't get distracted. Go take the lens back. Take the lens back. Otherwise, we'll end up getting lost. Okay, hello. I have the lens for you. I have the lens. Check it out, Snowdrop. Do you think this lens would fit? <gasps> this looks perfect. Oh my gosh, the telescope works again. Thank you so, so much. I have to go sleep right now. Huh? Why? It's daytime, which means the stars are sleeping. If I sleep now, I'll be wide awake later and the stars are awake too. Oh, and one more thing. Here's a drawing I made as a thank you. Snowdrop's drawing. Aww. Right, thank you for the drawing. Oh, oh, uh-oh. Oh no, why is it, why is, oh no, did we find a glitch? Wait, why, I'm praising you and now, <laughs> oh no, why is the drawing on the screen? Oh God, no, did we find a glitch? Oh no, there is like a way of saving it, hang on. So if I force quit, <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, okay. Hopefully we still have like the drawing and stuff. Okay, we did. Okay, we're all good now. <gasps> okay, well, first first glitch, I guess. Of course, we have to find it. Sorry, friends, if you get a glitch, just make sure you, I guess, save it often. Save it often, and you'll be okay. But yeah, I guess it still counts as, like, early access, maybe? I guess we just keep wandering around until we find new people to talk to. Oh, mushrooms! <gasps> Jumpy mushrooms! Jumpy mushrooms! Oh! Can we climb up here? Jumpy, can we do double jumpies? Can we do a double jump? Double jump? Can we go on the flowers? Oh! We can jump up here. Oh, we're glitching. <gasps> it's a it's a well! It's a giant well! Oh, hello? Well, uh wait, well, 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 a well! Oh, it's so cute. You shouldn't be here. Wow! Oh goodness gracious, okay. Who is it? Who are you, friend? They were like, you shouldn't be up here. Okay, well, I think we're meant to glide through this fence. So we're just gonna glide. We can make it. We're just gonna go wherever we want. Cause we are free. We are free. Oh, grains. Oh, hello. Oh, it's the rabbit's mom. It's Snowdrop's mom. It's Daisy. Hiya. Daisy's my name, running is my game. What's up? If you ever need any vegetables from the farm, just let me know. Oh, we'll do. I don't have any space in my backpack right now, but maybe another time. You're always welcome. Daisy! Congratulations, icebreaker! We got, we got like an achievement for that. Nice. Oh, hello! Oh my god, it's a hedgehog! It's a hedgehog! It's Annie the hedgehog! Oh, I think they're a hedgehog. I don't know, are they a hedgehog? I think it's a hedgehog. Hello, dear. I don't believe I've seen you around here before. Care to join us for a cup of tea? Oh no, I'm sorry, I'm on the job. Thanks for offering though. The name's Annie. Nice to meet you. My name's Maury. I'm a male scout. Today is my first day. <gasps> Wonderful. You're just who I was looking for. Really? What a coincidence. I need to ask you a big favor, Hon. How big? Like gravel big, stone big, rock big, boulder big? Hmm, not actually that big. I need you to deliver a letter for me to uh, Haley. Heck yeah. 
Lucky for you, that's my expertise. But it's a secret letter. You can't let Haley know I sent it. <gasps> Annie, the suspense. Please tell me what's in it. It's just some things I think she needs to hear. What kind of things? Like good things, bad things, funny things, scary things? Maury, less imagination, more, more mail delivery. Please, I wouldn't ask unless it was important. She's the nervous type and I happen to know there's something big on her mind. I hope this will help her calm her nerves and let her do what needs to be done. Okay, fine. I'll do my job quietly. Thank you, honey bun. Now run like the wind. Bring me... <laughs> run, run like the wind. Bring uh, bring my anonymous note to Haley. Whoosh. Okay, run like the wind. So we have a letter for Haley the duck. Okay, there's like a... Um, I guess we'll look over here. Can we go over the water? Normally in games you can't go in the water, so I'm just gonna assume that we're not allowed in the water. Okay, what have we got? We got some ladybirds over there. Okay, I guess we'll go see the ladybirds. Cool, these are some big cabbages and they got some carrots. Look, it's a ladybird farm! Hello! Hello, cutie ladybirds! Oh, I can't talk to them though. You can jump on all the mushrooms! There's a giant carrot. So it's like a little carrot patch. That's so cute. Okay, so we have to find where the duck is, I guess. We'll fly back over here. Let's go on the flowers. Maybe we have to like jump on the flowers. We can jump on the flowers. Oh God, don't glitch through. How do we get up here? Okay, ah, there's a rock there. Can we glitch across on the, the mushrooms? I'm guessing that's where we have to go. Oh, and also I love in the dialogue how they'll say the name of the person and they'll also have like a picture of the the person's face. Like if they were like an animal or a duck or something. Oh, can we get over here? Go! We can make it! Yeah! We did it! We made it! Okay, jumpy jumpy! Oh, it's like the little animal town! <gasps> and I see a ducky! I see a cute little ducky. Oh, they're so adorable. They should make plushies. Hello, are you Haley? Oh, fiddlesticks. Penny for your thoughts? Oh, it's just, it's just a case of just, oh, never mind. I can't even get the words out. That's okay, words are hard. Just skip the ones you don't want to say. What's on your mind? Ah, oh, don't worry, That's it's a personal matter. What's you got for me, little scout? I have no idea. But it's an envelope, right? Yeah, but inside, who knows? Not me. You'll just have to roll the dice on this one. All right, here goes. Who gave you this? No one. But also, what is in it? I'm really curious. It's the letter saying I need to drum up the confidence to do what makes me happy. It's not a bad idea. I just think I'm a bit in over my head. I would like to formally request that you spill the beans immediately. All right, but only because you are so nicely. I, uh, I have a crush. What? On Sana? Ah! I, I kind of want to ask her out. Oh! She seems to be breathing a bit uh, rapidly. Love quest! How do you want to do it? What's the plan? What do we need? Well, that's the problem. I want to give her something special to show I care in a special way. But I'm not sure what to do yet. Let me, let me have a think. Come back in a bit. Okay, okay. Yep, I can wait. No problemo. Oh, cute. I just love the animation. I want to like go in their houses. Let me just break into your houses. We'll have a little explore while she has a little think about things. Oh, there's someone up there. There's a friendo up there. Can we get to the friendo? Hello. Oh, are you a weasel? Right, okay. Who are you? Hi. What do you want? I'm a little busy right now. Come back later. Oh, okay. Irene doesn't want to talk to me. Irene's like, don't talk to me. <gasps> oh my God, is that a raccoon? Is that an adorable little raccoon? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Kiki? Kiki the little raccoon. Mail Scout, come here. I need you to send a letter for me. Oh, what are you sending? A cease and desist. Ah. Uh to a child that crossed me. That seems a bit overkill. I'll have you know, this child robbed me in broad daylight. I was walking with my coin collection. The bag was open. I was letting the coins breathe the fresh air. Then I was interrupted by the vermin child. <laughs> I can't tell if it's a raccoon or a cat. Oh, it could be a cat. You're right, it could be a cat. 
I just, I guess I was hoping it was a raccoon because I like raccoons. There might be a raccoon in it at some point. I think the name was Cedar. Cedar is such a cute name for an animal. Watch me cat, watch me call my next cat Cedar. She saw the glinting light and was fascinated by my coins, but I only had so long to walk before I had to go back to my business. The landlord's business, you know. Truly time consuming. Anyway, I must say, seeing a young fellow coin enthusiast, it was nice. It's not a popular hobby around here. I generally offered that Cedar admire my coins for one hour only and bring them back immediately. Well, Scout, it's been 61 minutes and my paws are empty. Now I must resort in stronger measures or else this child will walk all over me. Nobody messes with Kiki. Don't you think this is a disproportionate? Cedar is only a minute late. If you were paid to ask questions, wouldn't you be called a question scout? Well, I mean, oh, but you aren't a question scout. You are a male scout. And I have, I have a mail for Cedar. So why don't you run along and deliver it? Fine. Glad we agree. <laughs> oh, bossy kitty. What the hell is that? Is that like, is, oh, it's a stinky mushroom. It's a stinky mushroom. Oh, I see a bottle cap up there. Okay, they wouldn't talk to us. We spoke to them. Let's go get this bottle cap. Can we get it? Can we get that? I don't think we can, can we? Okay, so I guess we have to jump off the bridge to get up there to that bottle cap later. Right, okay. So anyone around here? Oh, is this Cedar? Oh, Cedar, you're so cute. Cedar? Uh, yes. Oh, I mean, depends. Who are you? I'm Murray the Mail Scout. In training. Uh, what was the last part? Nothing, nothing. Unfortunately, I have a not so nice other for you from Kiki. Oh, crumbs. Kiki's gonna make a lucky rabbit foot charm out of me. I just know it. Why? If you give him his coin collection back, I'm sure this will all blow over. That's just the thing. I, I lost the coins. I'm beginning to see the problem. I met Kiki while he was walking by here. As soon as I got my paws in the collection, I hopped off searching for a great spot to admire it. But I didn't realize the bag was still open. Now all the coins are lost and I have no clue where they are. Please, can you help me? I'm afraid of what Kiki will do if I show up without them. Fred, not little bun. I'll get you those coins back. Oh, thank you so much. There are four coins in the collection. Please come back when you found them all. Okay, so we gotta find four coins. Ooh, there's something floating over here. Oh, what did we get? Adventurer patch, woohoo. Nice, okay, I'll take it. <gasps> Friends, look at this. Look at this little pot made out of an acorn with a little acorn, little acorn cap on it. Stop it right now. This, I wanna live in this place. This beautiful, oh, lavender. Okay, I can see some mushrooms to climb up over there. Let me like fly across here. Climb up here. Ooh, are we climbing? We climbing. Oh, it's a little lantern! Cute! Okay, there's a big bridge over there. Okay, I guess we go on this bridge. We just go on this bridge. We go look around. Oh, it's a little honey pot! Oh, there's so many cute things to look at. Oh, there's someone down there we haven't spoke to yet. Oh, I don't wanna... I'll, I'll go talk to them in a second. Oh my god, there's so many places to go. Oh, there's some stuff over there too. There's a coin over there. Is this a coin too? Okay, we found another coin. Okay, all right, where do we go? Let's go over here. It's an apple tree. An apple tree, right. There's two places we need to fly to. I need to fly down here to get this bottle cap. Is it a bottle cap? I don't know what that is, but I got whatever it is. And then I guess we'll fly back around again to go to the mushroom tree because we need to jump off and get the coins. Back to the lavender. Oh, there was a way of it. Actually, no, we saw that squirrel, didn't we? Let's go talk to the squirrel. And then we go get that coin in a second, just because I will forget to talk to the squirrel. Oh, it's Egbert, Egbert the squirrel. Can't believe kids these days. Oh, didn't see you there. You shouldn't sneak up on an old man like that. I'm right in front of you. Maybe you need glasses. He's like wearing glasses. Never mind. Well, let's have a look then. Who's this? Maybe I really do need new glasses. Beg your pardon, who are you? Oh, no, sir, I'm new around this stretch of the woods. I'm a mail scout, here on official mail scout business. Mari, nice to meet you. Egbert, likewise. Well, don't let me distract you from your work. Okay, see ya. 
Unless. Unless. Unless what? Unless you're willing to help out an old man. L like a little side quest? See, it's a way to gain experience. Well, our number one rule is to serve the community. Actually, it might be rule 38. Anywho, what's the sitch? Sitch? Situation? You youngsters and your slang. Well, my upstairs neighbour is getting on my nerves. Seems to be in the nature of upstairs neighbours. They blast their rock music at the most tiresome hours, like 8pm. And the noise is driving me insane. I'd go up there and speak to them, speak some sense into them, but my knees aren't what they used to be. So if you could be so kind, could you hand them this formal co letter of complaint? Sure thing, Gramps. Uh, thank you for the trouble. Sure thing, Gramps. Oh my god, so rude. Sure thing, Gramps. Okay, upstairs neighbor. So I guess we have to climb back up here again. There was like a coin around here. We got to make sure we get as well. So who's the upstairs neighbor? Where was that coin? All right, I'm just going to get this coin real quick because I want to miss out on the coin. Let me just grab this coin. Woo! Oh no, it's a patch! Oh, was it a coin? What was it? I got something. Oh, okay, so we're looking for that weird rock kind of cuckoo looking guy, apparently. So we're gonna look for him, wherever he is. He's probably like, we probably have to go around, don't we? That little step that we saw. Do we have to go like this way? Ooh! Oh wow, there's like flowers and stuff over there, like Harrison's? There they are! They were sneaking! Kudos, kid! That was epic! It's Clarence, okay. Thanks. Wait, what? Getting up here without, you know, wings. Wings must be hell, hella convenient. Getting anywhere is a breeze. Or should I say, on the breeze. Ha 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 You're funny, amigo. You're one of them male scouts, aren't you? Reporting for duty. So what's the sitch? <gasps> That's what I said. Huh? When? Oh, wait. I remember. Uh, uh, never mind. I don't. Well, I was talking to Egbert and I was said, what's the sitch? Ah, uh, I can imagine the look on his face. Uh, must have had the gramps uh, straight flabbergasted. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can, can't say he understood. He told me to hand you this blah, 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 noisy music, blah, 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 third strike, official warning. Those sure are a lot of words. Too bad I'm not reading them. This music is in my soul. I just gotta let it out. You feel me? Not that would be unprofessional. Oh, you're talking about the music thing. Well, I do also enjoy my tunes from time to time. Same, same, pal. But I can't help that my song isn't nice and chill. I'm just not like the other birds. Hee hee hee, just goofing. Other birds are chill, even Kaz. Who? Don't worry about it. You'll run into the hymn if you're cool enough. Wait, do we have like some gay birds? Do we have some like gay birds? So what about Egbert's letter? Oh, just tell him, like, whatever. Sadly, I can't deliver a spoken word, even someone as moving as that. Well, um, well, this do, this is a used napkin with crayon written on it. And most importantly, a stamp. Well, I guess it qualifies as letter according to the male scalp handbook. Oh, I'll be on my way to Egbert. Hold up a second, little buddy. Pro tip from Claren the Claremeister. Hold A to glide down on the breeze. Nice and chill. Thanks, I'll give it a whirl. That's the Clarence Meister, what the hell? Now I kinda wanna fly over there though, cause that looks pretty interesting over there. And then we just go talk to the other guy later? Oh yeah, cause there's something over there as well. Okay, let's go, fly, fly, fly. There's something over on that, that thing. Okay, is this another bottle cap? Oh, it's a bottle cap. So you can collect the bottle caps as well. Right, let's go. Back over here, I see a little ladybird. Let's go over here. See something glistening and there's a caterpillar. And there's something glistening over there as well. Is this just like garbage? Oh, okay, I'm collecting garbage. Hello. Right, oh, it's socks. Socks the caterpillar. Approach, quiet, fastly. What's happening? No big talky time. Worms listening. Worms? Socks run today. Daily run. Thanks for the context. This time, trash everywhere. Yuck. No yuck. Delicious. But now, danger. Worm, worm hiding trash. Listen to Sock's private conversation. Why does he sound like freaking uh, Gollum? <laughs> it's literally sounds like Gollum. Destroy trash. Destroy worm. Comprehend? Let me get this straight. There's trash all around. See. And you think there are worms living in the trash. Spying on you? 
No, only socks. Or grumbly wood. Socks need privacy. Socks know many danger secrets. Cannot risk data leak. Right, right, of course, naturally. Five trash bits, bring here. Socks dispose, evidence gone. Happy end. Okay, I'll get you five pieces of trash then. Leave. Return only with trash. Okay, okay. Feed worm to bird. <laughs> oh my god, did you see that worm? <gasps> the worm. He really is spying. I just saw the little wormy. Right, I saw some trash over here. <gasps> Nether piece of trash. Nether piece of trash. Okay. Oh my god, it's another cute little rabbit. Hi, little bookworm. I'm a little worm. I'm a bunny. Buzzle the bunny. Stop it. Buzzle the bunny. Wearing the cute little freaking sweater. Stop it right now. Could it fool me? So, Buzzle the bunny, what are you reading? Oh, it's just a book on geology. Nothing special. Nothing special. Rocks are the best. Give me a, ro a, ro a rock fact. Mm, okay. So, rubies and sapphires, right? The red and blue gems? Yeah, yeah. Apparently, they're made of the same uh, mineral called corundum. Corund cor corundum. Corundum. Isn't that weird? They look nothing alike. Wow, that's incredible. So, they're like siblings that are totally different. Tell me about it. Sometimes, I feel like me and my siblings have nothing in common. None of them like to read like I do. And none of them care in the slightest about geology. I care. You do? Yeah. Listen, Basil. You go on and read some more rock facts. And I'll swing by to hear whatever cool facts you learn next. Wow, thank you. I'll get right to reading. Ah, <gasps> oh, me and Basil are besties. We're like best buddies. We're like best friends. Best buddy, best pals. Climb everywhere. Ooh, what's over here? More trash? More trash? Is that more trash? Okay, more trash. Cool. Right, how many pieces of trash is that? Three pieces of trash? Do you think all the trash is in the same area? <gasps> Hello, who are you, cutie? Are you a hamster? Is that a cutie hamster? You must be ham. Ham I am. My name is Ham and I like jam. I also like working out, reading long jogs on the beach. But those don't rhyme with my name. What a shame, doesn't rhyme with his name. Who is to blame that his love does not rhyme with his name? Such pain. And also lame. Okay, Shakespeare, read it in. Oh, sigh. 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 <laughs> what is it, Ham? I'm simply so bored. I'm bored of my favorite food. That's all? Ah. Uh, oh, I mean, go on. Ever since I was a little hammerino, I've been chomping blueberries and cheese like no tomorrow. It simply slaps tremendously, but now it slaps no more. This slap, the, the slapping has ceased. <laughs> now I feel stale and old and hungry. No purpose to live, like, live anymore. Hey now, it's not that bad. This means your taste buds are changing. A new combo will pop out that tastes amazing and you'll feel whole once again. All right, Scout. I should take this chance to refine my palate. Try the taste of the town. Cats probably has a good taste. He's an artist. If they know what colors go together, then maybe they know what good flavors go together. Uh, logic checks out. Let me jot down this letter. Here, could you take this to Kaz? He's in the purple cave, you'll find it. Can't wait for five star recommendations I'll have. Uh, sh sure thing, Ham, be right back. Ooh, now we gotta figure out how the heck we're gonna get, ooh, oh, we can jump on the pie. We we can jump on the pie. Oh crap. Oh, a bottle cap, cool. Wait, so I think the last thing we need to get is that over there, but I have no idea if we can reach it. Ew, we must be able to reach it, maybe from the bottle? Oh God, what's over there? There's like things in the distance. Okay, can we reach it? Cause I feel like there's no other way of getting up here. Oh, we did it, yay. Yay, we got all the garbage. We got all the garbage. Oh my god, there's a, there's a worm in the garbage. There's a worm in my garbage. What am I gonna do? There's a worm in my garbage. What am I gonna do? I think that's all of the the garbage, right? I don't want to kind of fly into the garbage. Fly into the garbage. Speak to the worm of the garbage. Oh no, he ran away. He ran away. He ran away. What a pretty little picnic that is. Okay, well, I thought, holy moly. He's like right close to my face. Damn. Okay, well, I told to worry me because I think that was all the garbage, right? 
I think that was all the garbage. Hi, Socks. Mori got trash? I do. Here you go. Finally. Mori useful. Thanks. It was a good idea to clean up the trash. The forest looks a lot nicer now, don't you think? Whatever. So, what are you going to do with all the trash? First check for worm traces. After, destruct. Maybe swamp help. Uh, maybe swamp help rat owes me. But Elliot sounded like you liked eating the trash? Yes. Trash good flavour. Not good for socks long term. Especially not worm trash. Give socks stupid worm brain. Oh my god, I have worm brain. <gasps> I guess I eat too much trash. I also have worm brain. Hee <laughs> I laugh. Socks never less than deathly serious. When trash gone, hunt new trash. Worm boss. <gasps> Worm boss! That's who we found in the well! The worm boss! Socks know he nearby. Socks smells him. Who's the worm boss? Better if Mori not get involved. Socks have only one thing to say to Mori. Oh? Despite annoying, Mori big help. The 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 the, the, the thanks. The, the the thanks? Now never speak of this again. Of course, my lips are sealed. What Socks just say? Mori, not big in brain department. Yep, true that, true that. Speak over now. Time Mori leave. Okay, bye socks, was fun. Oh my god, literally called out. Called out. Oh, I see another coin. I don't want to fall down though, so I'll get it in a second. We'll get that in a second. Let's go over here. It looks nice and swampy over here. This is our homeland. Hello? Are you like a little wombat? Hello, wombat. Hello! Oh, a capybara! It's a capybara! Cool! Sure looks like it. But that's not all. Oh? I'm a sad capybara. No! What do you got a feeling? Unhappy bara. My hat. It's gone! I feel incomplete without it. What does the hat of yours look like? It's round, orange. Smells kind of like citrus. So, it's a small orange? No, it's a hat. My hat. You're sure it's not an orange? Yes, an orange is a fruit, and this is a hat. But if it helps you to think of my uh, hat as an orange, then you can consider it an orange. But it's not an orange, it's a hat. Okay. Well, I'll go have a look for an orange-shaped hat, and I'll let you know if I find anything. <laughs> thank you, thank you. If you need me, I'll be here taking it out. Oh my god, he's literally in a barrel. He's in a barrel! <laughs> so that I can at least wear my hat in my dreams. See you later. Oh, he's called Max. Max the Capybara. Oh my goodness gracious. What a cutie. And he's just vibing in a barrel. Oh, what's under here? Is that his hat? Oh, did I find his hat? I think I found it, Max. I think I found your orange. Your orangey hat. Is this it? Max! Ugh. Are you awake? Oh, oh, I am now. What's up? What's up is your hat goes on top of your head. Uh, get it? Because your head is up? Never mind. Your hat, ta-da! My hat! <gasps> He's wearing a little orange on his head! Thank you, thank you, thank you! I'll never lose it again. Uh, it is an easy hat to lose, I must admit, with it being so similar to oranges. nuh -uh, you found my one hat of a billion of oranges. Obviously, it has a distinctive hat energy. Sure, we'll chalk it up to that. And not my supreme searching skills. Thanks again, Maury. Whenever I wear my hat, I think of you now. The highest honor. See you, Max. See you, Maury. Oh, oh, it's already safe. I'm like, save it always, just in case it glitches. Oh, it's so cute, the little house. How did we get over here, though? Because I saw a coin somewhere. Aha, here we go, the bridge. So we went across this bridge, and then I saw a coin, and I was like, I will get it later, because I don't want to... Oh, is it down there? There it is. Okay, oh, is it a bottle cap? Right, while we're up here, actually, we can have a little look around. <gasps> there's something in that tree log over there. And there's something up there as well. Oh, there's so many things. Wait, what's over here? Okay, wait, what is this? What is down here? Oh. Oh, I don't know what that was, but we got something. Also, I want to get this over here. There's a bottle cap over there. Bottle cap, bottle cap. Hooray! Is that all the coins now? I think the other thing was a bottle cap, so we don't have to worry too much about that. Okay, so this is where the goose and stuff lives. Okay, cool. So we don't need to go over here at the moment. Although, oh, we do need to talk to the squirrel. Hang on. Squirrel, I have a letter for you. Squirrel boy. Got a response from Clarence for you. They sent you a postage stamp and all. What ifs? 
Well, I never. I can't believe that scoundrel. If they won't listen, I will have to escalate to the, the, the situation. I really hope he wouldn't have come to this. For their, their and my own sake, I must form, sorry, file a formal complaint. Our landlord, to our landlord. <gasps> wow, that's quite a drastic move, my guy. Mm, I mean, are you sure my good client, patron, sir? I had hoped it wouldn't come to this, but I must, it must be done. Anyway, can you take this to Kiki? You already had to fill it out? Well, yeah. They weren't going to listen anyway. Could have saved me a trip up the tree, but it wasn't a great learning. It wasn't a great learning experience. Uh, what will I learn from taking to talking to a landlord? Bureau bureaucracy? Surely that's one of those patches for that. Mm, don't fuss about it. With all this experience, you're sure to earn some kind of patch. I'd better. Yeah, I better get a patch. We gotta go back to Kiki. I wonder if we've collected all the coins now, though. Where was Cedar and Kiki? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is this Cedar? I, I just want to see if we found all the coins. Right, Cedar. Hello, Cedar. Oh, Mori Mori, do you have all the coins? Yep, all four. Hug diggity dog. You're amazing, fantastic, stunning, breathtaking. And I will never forget this. Here, I've written an apology letter to Kiki. Could you take this and the coins back to him? Maybe now I can still make it out of here alive. Turns out you're not only a male scout, in training, but also a lucky charm prevention service. Seems there's a good money in that. It's my first day. I'm already holding a bag for the priceless coins. Ha 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 ha. Oh no, now I'm nervous again. Please bring the note and the coins to Kiki, okay? Got it covered, Cedar. Okay, now I gotta find Kiki again. Where the hell was Kiki? Kiki! Oh, there we go, Kiki's here. Okay, that's good. I guess if you get lost, you could probably climb up really high and just like look around to see, see if you need to find someone. Hi, Kiki! I have them! My coins! I guess you are at least a little capable. And there's a note from little um, Cedar too. Let's see what she has to say for herself. Shoot, this kid clearly respects me. Not sure why. And she obviously loves the coins. Ah, oh, Dan, darn it! I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna do something I said I would never do. Oh, what? Scout this collection. Although priceless, none of these coins are really important. This one, though, this is my favorite coin. The first coin I ever earned. Selling apple juice as a kid. As a kid, I was running my own letter to deliver. I'm sure that made you rich like my apple juice stand made me. Ah, uh, well, even though this coin means a lot to me, it, it shouldn't be gathering dust. It should live on in a new collection. Bring the coin to Cedar and the letter too. You know, a please wouldn't hurt, but I'll do it for Cedar. Oh, it's given him one of the coins. Oh no, don't get stuck again. <gasps> no, no, not again. Uh, oh, okay, it just saved. It just saved. Okay, so it seems that every time we collect something from someone, it glitches out. So we'll have to report that. I mean, maybe other people are experiencing it as well. But every time we collect something, it, like, glitches out. So oh, I guess this is a good time to, to save it, though. I really, really love this game so much. It's so freaking adorable. 